Hello and welcome to the Game Dev Outpost. In this video, we'll be talking about files in the Windows command prompt. Now there's a lot of situations where you may want to print something or return a message after you've entered in a command. But if you just try and write something out like, how are you? And you return that, the Windows command prompt will yell at you. So what we can do instead is we can use the command echo. Now say that we wanted to write that to a text file, we could type echo and then we say what we want to say, how are you? And then after that, we want to use the greater than sign to symbolize output. And then after that, we write where we want to output it to into something like hello.txt. And then we hit enter. And if you look at my file browser, you can see that there was a text document made called hello. If we open it up, it'll say, how are you? Now in this situation, I was just using echo because echo can return messages and then output messages but we can use other commands if we wanted to, like dir, and then we could output that to something like desktop.txt. And if we open that up, we'll see that we get our directory listings. Now if you want to try and read something that has text in it in the command prompt, you can type the command type, and then you can type the file name that you want to read. Now say that we wanted to write to the hello.txt file again, and this time we wanted to say, when are you? and then we output it to the hello.txt. If we read that file, you'll see that we overwrote what was there before. If you don't want to overwrite it, but you want to just add to the file, you want to type echo, whatever you want, and then you want to do two greater than sign. This means not only output, but append to the output. And now if we read it, you'll see it says, when are you, how are you? Now I'm going to make a directory on the desktop really quick. And if you want to move something, all you need to do is type in the command move. And then you want to type in what you want to move and where you want to move it. And now you can see that I moved the desktop txt into the turtles directory. If you want to rename a file, there's two ways you can do it. You can use the move command and you can type in the file that you want to rename and then what you want to rename it to. And the second command to rename files is REN. Now with either one of these commands, you're not restricted to the TXT file extension. You can change it to anything that you want if you know other file extensions. And you can see that in this situation, I changed disappointed.txt to still disappointed.jpg. Now, even though you can change the file extension or you can create something with a weird file extension, it doesn't mean it's gonna be a workable file. So if I try and open this, you can see that for some reason, Windows Photos doesn't understand it. And now since I don't know this both disappointed or still disappointed, we're gonna delete the file. We do that by writing out the command del and then we write out the file that we wanna delete and then we hit enter and then I'll delete the file. Alright guys, that covers files in the Windows command prompt. If you thought this video was useful and it helped, please let me know by commenting down below and liking the video. Thanks guys.